YouTube, Facebook, West. Instagram, Ask My Wedge. West. I'm with my big brother. Got a special guest tonight. One of the fighters in the family. Say what's up to the people. Yeah. He said, may the peace and blessings be upon you. Hey, so every time I talk about certain things, I like to have certain people around me keep me in check, you know? I don't want to just be talking to myself all the time like I do when I'm talking with y'all. But we was talking about Deontay Wilder. And uh, this is a special conversation to me because Deontay Wilder is a special individual. Thanks. Even though I have to put a hold on me praising him. For a long time I haven't did a video on him or I haven't really praised him for his accomplishments. When he does have a lot of great accomplishments. But... It's still the thing that is in the back of my mind is a love for the sport. And I hate to see people not fulfill the sport, all the obligations, all the way. And not to say Deontay Wilder didn't, because he is an Olympian. So he did his amateur thing, and he turned pro. He did it, he did it the right way. He didn't just come out and do whatever. But my problem with him is the same problem with every other authentic critic in this game is that his uh, fundamentals, oh my goodness, it look like they stopped on purpose. All his fundamental um, prowesses is, 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 is whack. You know, for example, he has a jab, he has a right hand, he has footwork, um, he has defense, he has power. He's a hitter. He, he knows how to do all those things, but he doesn't do them all the time. It's like he's immature in the game when it comes to doing things the right way. And that's all good. Everybody has their own style. I remember when I used to train with Joe Frazier, and they used to tell me in Philly Joe Frazier's I'm style sorry. was whack because, you know, he get hit too much because he's, he's just bobbing and weaving, you know. Something like Mike Tyson, but a little bit different, a little bit more square. Let's do that. But nevertheless... Deontay Wilder, his style is awkward also, but it's, it's one thing from being awkward and it's another thing from just being wild. Wilder got the perfect name, Wilder, because he just goes wild, especially when um, he has to increase his power and he gets motivated. He push hard and he goes wild. And that's all good, but my problem with him is I can't praise him all the way. <clears throat> because I believe a boxer beats a puncher any day. And I most punchers, huh? I disagree. You disagree? I've seen it too many times. You've seen a puncher outbeat a boxer? It's from the streets of the chain. I've seen it too many times. Alright, I can I can respect that. A boxer who can punch. A hitter. A hit. boxer. A boxer who can hit, a boxer who can punch, can a, beat a a boxer. A yes. hitter can take a blow as well as deliver a blow. Okay. I can respect that. A hitter can take a blow as well as deliver because he got that motion behind him. And you'll learn how to fight. You got to learn how to give. You got to receive first. Well, I True. come from off that street. You got to learn True. You got to receive for a year. True. Well, well, I mean, either way you put it is a right way and a wrong way to do everything. And Deontay Wilder thus far has not been um, an ideal boxer. I agree. You know, to 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 achieve the greatest of all time. Well, you got, you got that <laughs> to compare him to Muhammad Ali, nah, you know Ali and stuff like that, man. You you know, is inside and outside the ring. You have to reach a certain plaque. But plat he reaches goal. Goal is to get them bands. But he got his money. He, he he did it for his baby. I think his baby had some kind of illness, uh, and he did it for his baby. It was his dream for his baby, and he did it. Went through the amateurs, won a gold medal. So you can't you can't hate on him. But my whole thing is my whole thing it's is the it. only way only way critics can only way we can see how good you are if we're able to criticize you and able to critique you. And it's hard to critique somebody who's swinging like dog on a helicopter. <laughs> and you're a professional. It's hard to critique somebody like that, but. 
And you can't just say if you win, you win, and that's it. Nah. But the black man is a fan. I just want to see my brother win. That's what I really wanted to talk about tonight. Him and his. He's a proud African American. Yeah. And he yeah. he, he embraces people and he yeah. loves people and yeah. he supports people. He speaks yeah. about it daily. Yeah. I'm starting to see that continues. And uh, he's always talking about he wanted to uplift, encourage, and assist his people. Yeah. Yeah. So I mean, good boxer or not. The man still is um, a great man, and he, and he's growing into to be a great Big legacy right. of boxing because, like we was just talking about, right, 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 right. just like Big we was talking about, Muhammad Ali made a lot of his greatness outside of the ring. Deontay Wilders is doing the same thing. He's making a lot of greatness outside of the ring because when you think about it, you know nobody else ain't talking like him. Nobody else ain't. Was it uh, entourage? Yeah, nobody else ain't standing up for certain things like he's, he's almost looking awkward. And because of his lack of education, his, 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 his we call education, quote unquote, our, 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 our system education, this, this English education. So people don't take him for, they take him for granted a lot of times when he be saying things like, you know, we've been slaves for years, we've been this, we've been that, you know, and you know, Slavery, I don't, I don't be talking, when I talk about slavery and reparations and all that and getting ourselves together, I'm not talking about going to war and hating white people. You know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about hating nobody. What I'm talking people. about, exactly, they part of our blood. Especially that women. White people the same, 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 same with us. My thing is, we got to come to a, and they a understanding that we are a people that we are a people and we can never come united on in peace not in not in war black black man gotta love himself first and then his brother second well i mean my theory is a little different from that. a lot of people believe that black man's got to love ourselves first and like they believe we got to come together before we can come together whatever i don't believe that i believe that <clears throat> i believe that we all humans, and we can't come together as black people until we come together as man. Well, me being Muslim, I have an unfair advantage. Of, in, my, in my eyes, I understand over everybody else. All right, all right. I figure I got ups in y'all, because I, I believe in Allah. No doubt about it, but everybody ain't on that level yet, so we gotta talk to the people. That's so why they I can support understand. brother like Wilder, because he's not, he's not where I'm at, but I respect and I'm grateful for him being where he is. I feel you, I feel you. I feel you on that. So anyway, big shout out to Wilder. Um, we gonna we gonna still come to see what he do in boxing as a boxer. Um, he's not on Muhammad Ali level, but as a human being, as a great man in the sport world of sport, he's 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 working on to be Muhammad Ali. He's the best of yet right now because he's the only one speaking out. He's the only one speaking out, and there's always the so-called uneducated man that speak up. If you look at in American history, all the men, real. Huh? Right here? All the men who, who, who spoke out against um, the adversity amongst the people, yeah. all the people who spoke out was so-called unlettered. Uneducated. Uneducated unlettered. people. Same thing. Yes. So Deontay Wilder, man, much no learned, man. education. Don't think I'm showing hate on you just no because degrees, no scholars. I say your boxing skills but he are got questionable. He got hella common sense. Now, but your common I'm sense. I'm thankful for that. And your love for yourself, man, you right on, man. May Allah guide you to the to the truth. Keep guiding you to the truth and, um, and let you be one of those who spread it. Peace, inshallah.